this video is gonna be how to lock in before the upcoming new year 2025 you just want to be ahead right when it's 2025 you want to be already on your way you don't want to just like just starting to get going you don't want to just starting to get started i'm just going to be sharing like some of the things that i wish i would have known i have you're going to need to have a healthy mindset before you try to do anything that is going to challenge the current you especially if you are planning to make a great shift in your life a positive mindset is the most important thing that you can have for whatever you're trying to do you're trying to be successful in your spirituality in business in your academics obviously your mindset can't change from one day or the other right it's basically positive reinforcement positive affirmations that you tell yourself that whenever you're feeling oh i can't go to the gym like you have to remind yourself and tell yourself yes you can for me i think what how i changed my mindset was i can't wake up in the morning it's so hard instead of thinking that in the morning i've shifted my thinking into being like it's only right now that is the most difficult part as soon as i get up as soon as i get changed as soon as i get there i'm gonna want to work out have a strong why so before you get into doing anything, whether you're studying, going to the gym. So for me personally, the reason why I started to go to the gym was because I was tired of being the person that was saying that they were going to be a better version of themselves. My actions were not aligning with that. That was like, I want to say like one of the base whys. I wasn't, you know, getting my exercise in, I wasn't feeling very good. On here I put, to not let yourself slip because the weather is too cold, you're too tired or some out of the norm happening anyways moving on the next thing that i have on here is build your morning routine specifically for your winter arc if you need time to be in bed defrost before physically getting up set your alarm up earlier than early how you start the day is going to reflect the rest of the day as far as your motivation and momentum so i'm the type of person what i've learned about myself is that when it comes to morning routines because it's so hard for me to wake up i can't let myself defrost when i get up i have to like push the covers off and like get up build a morning routine that you know you need not so much of like what aesthetic or what you think you should do because somebody else is doing it energy is currency not hang around people that are draining your energy not supportive of the shift in your life put your phone on do not disturb if you have to choose healthy foods Choosing healthy foods does not have to be difficult. It can be if you leave it to last minute. Am I going to be following an 80-20 rule, 90-10 rule? It really does matter what you put into your body. Whatever you're doing, if you're going to start waking up early, you're going to want to feel your body the right way. You don't want to eat junk food after you're working out, have your energy plummet. Prayer meditate say some gratitude in the morning ask god for strength to get you through the habits that you're trying to implement in your routine and then i have this quote that says the same power that raised christ from the dead dwells in you the same power that raised christ from the dead dwells in you read a self-help book the self-help book that i recommend that i will always recommend atomic habits by james clear for starters some of the stuff that i have on this list i got from that book it's just gonna break down you as a human how us as humans we are creatures of habit how to use that for you not against you how to build on that how the smallest habits can create atomic results give yourself some motivation give yourself some insight on yourself that way that you can see when you're going wrong and how to fix that practice discipline what has helped me when i got into the habit of pivoting so i noticed that like say i'm on, on tiktok i'm doom scrolling i'm on there for like an hour is to just put the phone down and go to the restroom put the phone down go walk to the living room sometimes you just have to do something without thinking about it being disciplined doesn't have to be hard it could very much be easy if you have a strong why enjoy your journey celebrate your small wins after you complete your week of eating healthy have a movie night go for a coffee uh, but obviously this can be you know this can be different for everybody you know maybe sitting down and reading the luxury to read and not feel guilty about it practicing these habits are going to help you get a head start so that when the new year comes you're not confused or spending any time trying to figure out what you're trying to do when you start the new year you don't want to be another one of those people that's like trying to find motivation that's starting that's 
doesn't know how they're gonna keep it up like no you're already gonna know how you're gonna keep it up we could do this you could do this i could do this we could do this and it's not impossible it's only as hard as you make it out to be it's really how you think and what you tell yourself that's all i have for this video thank you for watching thank you for being here see you in the next one